Well, South Africa is still commemorating Family Day today, and it also happens to be the premier date for S3's brand new telenova, uh, the estate, which is centered around five families who are tied together through secret and lies and drama, and it sounds just <laughs> like we need so what we need. So much deception. There's been so much hype around this, especially last week. Everybody in Mzansi is frothing for this. So we got Tabiso to recently go on the set to connect with the cast and crew ahead of tonight's debut, debut. and he chatted to actress Nambita Ben Mazwi, who you might be familiar with, and it's a familiar face to the loyal S3 viewers and a former presenter search on three top 10 finalists. Well, let's check out what Tabiso has got with the latest on the estate. Thanks for staying with your Feel Good Breakfast Show Expresso here on SABC3, helping you escape the norm this morning because we're coming to you from the set of a new hit series to hit your TV screens yes. here on SABC3. It's called The Estate. And joining me is someone who many people first saw internationally when she was on the screens over here, over there, and everywhere, featured as a collaborator on Beyonce's Black is King. And of course, this time around, bringing all of the magic Locally here at home, oh yes, as Gigi on the estate, yes. Lady Nam, Nambita, Ben, Mazui. So good to see you. Listen, can you just hype me up everywhere I, mean, I go? I, I think I need to can be you your, do my intro? your praise singer. Yes. Must I like go like in costume? <laughs> oh, Ina. Now I'm going to get it. Oh, I'm going to get it. Oh, I'm going to get it. Oh, I'm going to get it. Yes. 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 Wow, wow. If you were otherwise known as? Georgina. Gigi, come on. Gigi. Okay, so let's talk about this incredible role. And I'm hearing your directors already yes. yelling at remarks and directions there. This Quiet is a fantastic thing. How does it feel for you moving from very fresh off an international show that really did so well and uh, sharing that this magic Grammy. that won a Grammy yeah. and bringing that magic here and flexing locally? <laughs> <laughs> Jeez, sure. Um, it's actually absolutely amazing to be back on the local uh. screen. That, for me, is the most important. You know, I've been so incredibly blessed right now yeah. um currently on three hit shows so there was a moment where you know a lot of people on social media are like look more now where have you been yeah. da, da, da. and of course you can't forget the local audience so i'm so ecstatic to be back on the small screen well this is incredible and here you are now yeah. on sabc3 helping us all escape the norm on the mm. estate how's this experience coming along for you well first of all i am gigi as we speak so this is the taste <laughs> that you guys are going to have this i'm in hint. full costume i am in character fully now the yeah. hair the shoes yeah. the makeup yeah. the dress yeah. um so you've really took took me yeah. at work <laughs> while I'm in character. I so this is a bit of Gigi and Lady Nam <laughs> amalgamated. Combined. Yeah, but are there it's any been... similarities between the two characters? Ooh, no, personalities? no, there yeah. are a few similarities. Mm. Georgina, there's a lot more similarities, but you guys will have to watch because there's Gigi, there's Georgina, and that's the clear juxtapose. I'm, yeah. I'm basically a plot twist. I'm constantly a plot twist. Every single time I enter screen, mm. you're going to be sitting at the edge of your screens, you're going to be like, what is she going to do now? You know, I, so that's I, that, that's what I'm thinking. I'm bringing. literally on my toes right now <laughs> as you explain all of this because I'm ready to take it all in. Yeah. But this is an incredible show because mm. it's, it's it's a first of its kind on our yes. TV screens. And it's been a long time since we ha had a TV show or a TV mm. series like this on SABC3. What do you think it's going to bring to the landscape? Oh, my gosh. You know what I love about the estate mm. is that it's bringing relevant mm. conversation starters. Mm. It's We're talking about topics that are quite serious. We know mm. we're, we're talking about land issue, mm. land reform. It's mm. also a juxtapose of two worlds. It's pretty much like your Santon and Alex, mm. which are so near each other, mm. but the poverty line is huge, the inequality is huge, mm. and it's going to tackle real issues, and we're going to start having these conversations ourselves. Yeah. Of course, there's an the entertainment value, yeah. um, and we're telling stories, we're telling people stories, and it's so well represented. Mm. That's the most exciting part. You have a Afrikaans family, you have a Posa family, you have a Zulu family, mm. you have every single culture represented so for me, every single person will get to see themselves. Yeah. They'll get to see their own families and cultures. And yeah. that, I think, is missing right now. We have authentically Zulu shows at, yeah. at times or Sutu ones. Yeah. But to have every single South African see themselves in a television, mm. um, television telenovela yeah. is, is going to be a first of its kind. It hasn't been done in a while. It's a huge take, right? It's mm. a huge sort of take on or responsibility to be able to carry narratives like that and bring mm. them across in the most amazing way, in the most bold ways. And the most glamorous see. way. I mean, look. Look at glamorous this. ways too. I mean, look at that. <laughs> you don't even have to twirl at any angle uh, when getting it all. But I want to. Hey, but you can twirl. Okay. Do your thing. Okay. As okay. you twirl, maybe tell me and let me in on, uh, uh, you know, what it takes for you to prepare and get into 
I suppose, the hybrid that is Gigi and uh, Georgina. I must take a lot. How do you sink your teeth into the character? Sure. Um, you know what? It's you asking me the most prevalent question right mm. now at such a crux point in my life because I'm juggling two different productions. Mm. And, you know, I'm shooting every single day and the two characters are so vastly different. Yeah. And then there's me. You yeah. know, I still need to find myself. So I'm currently How do you being do it then? three people in the space of 24 Who hours. Who am I speaking to now? <laughs> Listen, I'm even <laughs> asking myself that. So my process, you know, I'm someone who really takes on my characters. Yeah. I become. You mm. know, I'm a method actor. I mm. really go deep in and sometimes, you know, I, I need to tap out and mm. I have to find new coping mm. mechanisms, mm. you know, to center myself and ground myself back again. So, you know, my, my faith is number one. You know, I literally will put on praise and worship as I go home and that kind of just centers me back to who I am and my identity. Talking to family, of course, is also just a way to, you know, because they're going to be like, okay, girl, snap out of it. Yeah. You know, they'll call yeah. you by that nickname that you grew course, up with. So that's, that's, that's it. So the process for me is, you know, I wake up very early in the yeah. morning, I meditate, I do yoga, mm -hmm. I, I, I train, and then I really get into the script. Um, and and by the time I then get into the makeup yeah. chair and start the process, that yeah. that's me slowly becoming Gigi. Yeah, the makeup, yeah. the Smooth hair, into it. yes. The, so so that helps me. And now I'm Gigi yeah. fight. Yeah? Well, we've watched this morning, and I have really been in such complete awe yes. watching how the pieces of this machine come together. Mm. What's the one thing you've really enjoyed about working on this production of the estate with the cast that you work with, with the crew that you're oh, working with, yeah. and of course the team at SABC3. First and foremost, it's so good to be back on SABC3. Mm. I haven't done any SABC3 actual productions yeah. in a while. It, it was always mm. presenting. Yes. So for me, it feels so good to be part of that family again. Mm. Um, it's exciting also dealing with clients and, mm. and, and how innovative the PR is and mm. marketing is. So that's also just like, oh, yeah. you know, um, and having that support yeah. from client as well. Um, there's no way I'm not going to mention the cost. I'm working with my friends, you know, you, you so it's a job. Yes, it's all. a yeah. Um, and it's an award-winning cast, you know. A lot of them I've worked with in previous shows. Mm. So it's just, it, it feels like a family. Everyone is just so loving. Everyone just wants to make the show a success. Um, there's no egos. Mm. It's just, we, we're, we're, we're all committed to making the scene great. Yeah. We have true thespians working on it. So that's mm. always so refreshing, you know. And, and, and that's, that's the most part that I love about it, yeah. Well, the thing is, we're all going to connect with this story and all yes. of these characters in whatever way that's going to be coming through and you're going to want to make sure that you're a part of it at 7 p.m. on the 5th of April here on SABC3. It's the estate. It will premiere and you're going to see the dy dynamo yes. and the dynamic nature of these characters, Gigi, Georgina, or Lady <laughs> Nam coming together Woo. and really exploding on your TV screen. Connect with us on our social media. Hashtag Expresso Show. Let us know what you think and what you're most looking forward to seeing. You're amazing. Go act. Thank you. Catch you later. Let me go, hey, go act, because go you're it's getting hectic. It's hard not to want to follow. <laughs> I want to see more. To those that know me, know that family is everything to me. My father said a man's land is his kingdom. You are not going to buy our souls with your jobs and your money. But if it wasn't for my taxi money, you wouldn't have had that estate. Well, at least we know that our ancestors both love money. You have a good marriage. Don't mess it up, brother. Hey, our chocolate. Uh, well, I mean, who doesn't want to live at Echelon Estate? Uh, uh. Introducing a new daily drama with an award-winning cast. <sighs> to the dream. To the dream. The Estate starts Monday, the 5th of April at 7 on 3.